morning friends i just woke up and it's like a bunch of pimple patches on my face but it's fine hi friends um basically this video was supposed to be me getting ready for s-pop i wanted to put it in my s-pop vlog but uh, it was too long so i just decided to split it up and put it into this video i hope you guys enjoy it uh, if you want to see more videos like this, please click the subscribe button and also touch my bell. Touch my bell downstairs, okay? And then, uh, yeah, okay, back to the video because the girl is currently editing this video and I realized that it doesn't make sense to split both of them up, so... Enjoy the video! My eye is getting a little red, you can see. And also, the pimple patches didn't do much of a job, so... <sighs> I'm just doing my skincare now and I should be ready to head out of the house soon. Uh, okay, my eyes are starting to look a little better, just a little bit. And I just put gel on my other eye. Great! Ah! Uh. <laughs> okay, not bad. It's fine. Ah, today is just not my day. I used to be like balding and now I'm just. At this stage where hair is like growing back. Which is great. But I'm still boring so. Okay next I'm just going to prime my face. Nothing fancy. Going with some foundation. This is the gel foundation by Healthy Mix Serum. I mean Bojoris. Bojoris? What am I gonna say? I'm just gonna dot random dots in my face. I like this because it's like lightweight and it's not exactly a foundation foundation, it's like a gel-ish. And then I just... I, I look crazy right now but pat my face till now I'm done. Alright, okay. There's that. And now I'll move on to concealer. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna do with my brows first. I'm just taking the Etude House Play Pencil 101 and using the flat angled brush. Ooh, fancy. <laughs> okay, I sound so lame right now. But okay, I'm just gonna take this timber shade, this very dark brown shade, and just fill in my brow gaps. I should probably comb it first. Yeah, I should comb it first. Just using a screw brush and combing it. Alright. Now I'm filling it in. With this. I don't want to fill too much because I'm going in with black colour later, so I'm just giving up a general guideline. Okay. Next, I'm gonna go in with this black colour shade called Onyx. Like the Pokemon, but it's black. Okay. Making myself sound like a geek every day. Great. Being a geek is fine. So, just, just me. I'm not a geek because I'm not smart. <coughs> My throat's feeling a little rusty today. I'm not gonna be enjoying this day, maybe. I don't know. But we're gonna hear like good music later, so I'll as well. Me being biased right now, this will come out after s pop but I hope Karina wins. If not, Marcus. But I like them all four, so... I mean, they're all very nice people. And, like, I hope they're an equal chance of fighting, and... I don't know what's gonna happen on stage later anyway, so... Hope they perform well. I just really hope Karina wins. <laughs> Lol. Love Karina. But if any of them- Oh my gosh! Okay, that was close. <laughs> my cap dropped. But if any of them wins, I don't mind. Like, they, they all deserve to win, so... Alright, they filled in. Seriously, I hate it whenever like, I do stuff and then I just forgot what I'm supposed to do next. It's so annoying. Like, I'll just take up time just doing this. Okay, can. Um... I'm just gonna go with 
doing my eye makeup right now. I'm gonna go in with this Etude House Play color palette, the Cafe Holic palette. You wanna see it? It's this, the Cafe Holic palette, and I freaking love the shades in there. Like they're so pretty. Like look at this. This is so pretty. I love, I love this so much, and like all these shades, I would all wear all, like all of them. So this. I mean, essentially, that's what you want to do when you buy a palette, right? So... I like, love the fall time for like, fashion and makeup time because like, I'm a warm skin tone, so it kind of suits me. Most of them suits me. And I love that about the thing, so... I'm, I'm just gonna put like, random colors on my face, so it's gonna be... It's not really much of a teachable thing. Not even teachable. I don't even teach things. I just play with shit that I like to do. Can you even see the color? It's so far away. You probably can't see me, but meh. Yeah, that's about it. Meh. I'm just filling up my under eye because it's kind of important to do so. I don't know why I'm going for such a dark color today, but alright, we're going in strong today. Just using the dark color there to like line, sort of line my eyes. Keep it close to the lash line, I guess. Alright, I'm done with my eyes, now I'm gonna go on to setting my eyebrows. I actually want to go in with a mascara but I'm not gonna do that. I'm just going to go straight to setting my eyebrows with an eyebrow gel. I'm just gonna use this Etude House eyebrow gel to set. So I don't want it to be too strong. Alright. Just I like to set it lightly with some gel. There we go. And uh, I don't know how to make my eyebrows similar because they're never gonna be similar. They are like different. I mean, they have a general art shape, but like. Mmm, <clears throat> cannot. I cannot, Malay. Sorry. I'm just gonna go in the same concealer. This thing is so good. I I freaking love this stuff. Like it's very high coverage. And it also lasts lasts. It also lasts a really long time. Wait, let me just blend it out first. And it matches my skin tone perfectly. That's amazing. It just does a really good job of keeping my pimples unseen. And it also smells like baby powder for some reason. Not complaining. I love baby powder. So going to attempt on my under eye dot. Just taking the concealer really lightly. Look, my eye bags are like almost gone. Like I've never f came across a concealer that can hide my eye bags so well and last that long. So just, just you know, putting it out there. And this was really cheap as well. Like three dollars. Now it's still done. Okay, great. This is why I can never do a makeup tutorial even though I already would be posting up one. Hmm. Watch out for that. It's gonna be great. Okay, never mind, I'm kidding. Um I'm gonna powder my face with this face shop powder. Face shop oil clear blotting powder, yes. This was the cacao line. The one with Mr. Peach. In the, uh, This powder is actually quite fine. I would not 
know if it's a dupe for anything because I've never tried the high-end ones because your girl's broke and um I would love to try it but I don't have the chance to so oh I didn't I didn't I did jeez I did not conceal the mm, my gosh why not great okay let me, never mind let me just Conceal my pimple at the top, as you can see, it's very clear and very big And I don't know how I missed that, but yeah It's great! Welcome to my channel, guys! I'm so annoying, eh? seriously Stop myself! I love this thing Innisfree oil... Oil something... No sebum... Comp compact... No sebum pack it's already all right, wiped out already, as you can see. I've been using it for quite long. Like maybe about a year or two. And I'm still not done with it, which is great. I'm going to take a fluffy brush and just pat my face to get the excess powder to spread. Okay, I realized my eyeshadow is a bit. <laughs> too strong in your face so I'm just gonna take the shade sand here and just blend it out is that how makeup goes talk I'm blending it out I didn't want it to be so dark today so I just alright it's lighter now I feel a, a little bit better just blend out the bottom as well. I've got this cut blush in um, first class and it's a uh, sample size. It's good. I love it. I um wow. I love this color. It's like this peachy peachy nude color on my skin. It looks good because my skin is my skin tone is kind kind of dark. Kinda dark? I seem like for um okay it's not dark but it's comparing to like you know it's kind of Korean Korean skin like super super white Korean skin. Yeah I don't have that. Um I'm not complaining, I love my skin tone and um but would be nice if I had a lighter skin tone because a lot of blushes they just don't show up on my face, especially the Korean ones. And this does the job pretty well, like it has this very nice um, peach colour and it shows up on my skin Nah, it sho shows up on my skin quite nicely And it's light and it's not dark and it's showing up on my skin I'm putting it all over my cheeks because it's easy and I like to do that Makes me look cute <laughs> Not exactly but you know Done with blush, and I'm going to go on to. This is also by Tarte, and um, this is the Park Avenue Princess Bronzer. It's also in a sample size because, um, do I need to further emphasize that your girl is broke? So, I'm just gonna take this. Like, all these sample sizes, actually, to be honest, is quite worth to me. To me, it's quite worth because, like, you get enough for, like, a really long time. So, as a broke student, I just suggest that you just get the smaller ones instead of the huge full size ones that you will never finish in your lifetime. So, I mean, if you use it every day and you love it, then just and you can buy it. So, just by all means, go ahead and get it. But I can't. <laughs> but it's so good. I love this thing. It's subtle and it's great. Okay, uh, I'm just gonna bronze this face up. I'm gonna use this small brush that I used for my eyes just now because, say it with me, your girl's broke. Just sticking this and contouring my nose. And also, mind you, these were like cheap brushes. These were like Daiso brushes that I got for. $11 for 3 brushes and usually brushes would cost like picking $40 for 1 brush so I'm just like done I, I cannot 
And this does the job well, so I just don't mind it. Great, my thing just stopped recording halfway and I'm um, just going to curl my lashes because there's not enough memory space on my card. I keep filming shit and I just don't have enough space for things. My lashes don't stay, what am I doing? Uh, okay. I'm gonna put a brown mascara by Ethnic House. This is extremely waterproof, which I freaking love it. But other than Ang more eyelash, uh, what's that? Don't say Ang more. Other, <laughs> other like American brands or American makeup that I've tried using, they just don't hold my lashes, my tiny Asian lashes as well as I would hope them to. But this, on the other hand, holds it up really well. A curl fix one, in case you were wondering. I'm going with my highlighter. This is the Becca Champagne, Becca Skin Perfector and Champagne Pop. I've heard so much about this thing, and it's amazing. But this is in um, travel size and also small size because I'm never gonna finish this in my entire lifetime. This is good enough for me. It's great. This one. Well. Alright. There you go. And we're done. It's me again. Uh, hi. I just wanted to say bye because I feel like it was a bit funny that I didn't say bye. So, bye. <laughs> Hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up and also click subscribe down below. And also comment other videos that you want me to do. I know if you like have anything to tell me or what, just type down says, you know. <laughs> Anyways, my first time doing this kind of get ready me video, so I feel a bit uh, weird. Just bear with me until I get used to me talking to somebody that is not really there, you know. Love y'all. Bye friends.